my channel the mom life 7 today I have another 99 cents store haul for you guys um, it's basically what is it Saturday <laughs> it's probably after midnight having trouble getting the kids to sleep anyway um, I wanted to get this video up because tomorrow I'm planning on filming a video um, like a Valentine's Day um, meal idea and then I have a, another uh, like a really cute um, Dollar Tree um, haul that I want to get up hopefully if I don't get it tomorrow which I doubt it probably Monday on the um, holiday month um, daughter be out of school she has a three-day weekend anyway um, I wanted to welcome all the new subscribers and I want to thank all the um, my other subscribers for coming back again and uh, watching me and I really appreciate everyone and if you haven't already, please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Please give me a big thumbs up. I appreciate it. I need all the support I can get. And uh, let me see. I hope I didn't forget anything. And if not, let me just jump into this haul and get it over with. Okay. Let me try to get the perishable cold stuff out the way. Okay. Um, I picked up this uh, Philadelphia cheesecake. Now, this is like my, this is a repeat buy. I had previously got strawberry and then last time I think it was chocolate and this time it's uh, what is it salted caramel yeah salted caramel so this is the Philadelphia cheesecake salted caramel no artificial flavors or dyes you get two cheesecake cups in here uh, expiration date is March 22nd 2018 so this is 99 cents that was pretty cool all right let me see what else I got perishable here oh ready okay I have these um, Pillsbury Grand's crescent rolls 50% larger than uh, original crescent. Okay, big and flaky. I had seen a recipe someone had did one time with some crescent rolls. We we had previously got the um, what was the name of that brand? I can't think of it right now. But we've been getting a lot of that brand. And we make, baked the crescent rolls from there, and it was pretty good. Okay, expiration date on these are March 8th. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, 2018. And what you get like eight of them in here? Something like that. Oh yeah, eight big rolls. Okay, so that was 99 cents. I thought that was cool. All right, another cool find was this Annie's Organic Flaky Biscuits. Okay, uh, and like I said, they're organic. You get eight ready to bake biscuits made with goodness, no artificial flavors, synthetic colors or preservatives, no hot hydrogenated oils and uh, unbleached flour. Got a box tops on there. Let me see. These were 99 cents. That's really good. Expiration date is March 29th, 2018, so that's an excellent date. All right. I was so, so excited when I saw these because I think around the holidays I saw people posting pictures and um, they had found these, but they were like the big pack. And where you get eight of them in there. Normally I buy the big pack around the holidays from Sam's Club, and I know it's it's not you know, 99 cents. Even for this pack, you know, if I'm doing just a regular size um, dessert, I actually use these for my peach cobbler, to be honest with you. I know some people bake the um, crust from scratch, and I'm not there yet. I'm, I'm going to give it a try, but sometimes, being a busy mom, I just have to go with the flow. Now, everything else I put in there, you know, but um, as my creation, but for the, for the um, crust, I just buy this because it's easier for me. You know, one day if I have the time, I may go ahead and make me some crust from scratch. But right now, mm -mm, I'm trying to do it quick and easy. Anyway, you get two pie crusts in here. Just unroll, fill, and bake. Um, I love these. I love this brand. This is the, my go-to brand. It's the only brand I use for it. And for 99 cents, that was excellent. I actually bought six of these. Um, they were bringing them out. Expiration date, let me see. March 16, 2018. 2000, March 16, 2018, they were bringing them out, and I saw them. The lady kept saying, yeah, we got pizza crust back there. We got pizza. We got um, pizza crust. I saw them. I'm like, oh, no, that's my Pillsbury pie crust. <laughs> what is she talking about? Pizza crust. Obviously, she doesn't bake, but anyway. So, I grabbed six. Um, four for myself and two for my aunt. So, tomorrow, I'm going to have a recipe coming up for you guys with this. So, be on the lookout for that. I got uh, four of them. I may not need all four. Hopefully, I can freeze some hopefully okay hopefully all right i also was excited to find this uh, dole 100 percent juice again this is the pineapple orange banana 
expiration date is February 22nd, 2018. I, we were, you know what? We were low on beverages, so I was actually looking for beverages, and I happened to find some today, so that was great. This is a 64 fluid ounce. This is 120 calories per 8 ounce serving. No sugar added. It's pasteurized. Yeah, excellent dip deal and it's a repeat buy i actually bought two of these guys because like i said we were low on beverages all right another cool find was this minute made uh premium heart wise orange juice uh, let me see proven to help reduce cholesterol let me see two eight fluid ounce servings per day with meals oh, okay 100 percent juice just like the dole juice this is pope free i love pope free orange juice <laughs> um and it's um expiration date is february 28th 2018 and this is 59 fluid ounces, 110 calories per 8 ounce serving. And yeah, hey, it's Minute Maid. It's a name brand. The Dole's a name brand. Bringing y'all name brand so far. So I only grabbed one of those because I am really seriously limited on space, you guys. So um, yeah, space is a problem for us right now. But we did need some beverages. So I did get some. I just couldn't go ham on it. All right. Another cool find was this um, Pure Leaf um, Real Brew Tea. Now... I remember the first time I actually tasted pure leaf tea and I really loved it but then after a while I once I tasted the gold leaf the gold leaf uh, well, no gold peak I said gold leaf gold peak became my favorite this is not my favorite but it's still good so and it's a good brand and it's a, it's a good tea you know brewed from real leaves uh, 100 calories per serving it's a 59 fluid ounce bottle let me see if I can find a date for you guys that'd be great uh, <laughs> I don't know if I can find it. Hmm. And guess what? It don't matter. And I'm not going to spend too much time looking for it. Because <laughs> I don't know where it's located on here. All right. Anyway, I grabbed two of these. This is the lemon flavored one. So, yeah. That was cool. For 99 cents, I know how much this costs in the regular store. So, you know, it's like I said, it's not my go-to brand. It's probably my second favorite. <laughs> but not Gold Peak is my first one. So, I grabbed two of those. All right. And look at this, you guys. How amazing is this? How cool is this? I kept seeing everybody um, haul these or, you know, was showing that these um, these had showed up at the store. I think I saw Vivian Rodriguez and I'm not sure who else. <laughs> and uh, this is the Naked. It's a fruit smoothie berry blast and berry blast expiration date. This looks like it's February 28th, 2018. And it's a 64 fluid ounce bottle. It's no sugar added. 130 calories per eight ounce um, per eight fluid ounce serving. And this is, I mean, you, you guys know. This stuff ain't cheap, especially you buy the, the small bottle. It's not cheap, so yeah. I grabbed two of these. I could have actually grabbed more of all this stuff, but I, I don't have a lot of space, so <clears throat> I didn't. I just grabbed what I feel like I can manage for now, and this should get me through until the next, hopefully, batch of <laughs> drinks come through. Okay, <clears throat> another um, find for me uh, was the green onions. I don't know how many get in here, but it was ninety-nine cent. And I'm going to be making something really soon, and I'm going to need some green onions. So, yeah, grab me some fresh green onions. All right, what else do I got over here? Any other goodies? Okay. Now, hmm, y'all going to have to excuse my wrapping this for a second. But I actually have been seeing these for a while. So, if you see they're open, that's why they're in the zip like bag. I've been seeing, have been seeing, seeing these for a while. These are the Original Gourmet Premium Wafers. This is the lemon cream flavor. I also have um, the vanilla cream. Uh, these are, let me see, this is 7.5. I guess they're all the same. Yeah, seven, seven ounces. And they were 99 cents. And I actually had the chocolate, but I was actually, we were out running around hitting some stores hauling. And I was hungry. <laughs> Me and her, we were hungry. So we ended up eating that. We saved a little bit to come home for them to try to, you know, people at home and um, my daughter and stuff. And uh, yeah, so. Um, I wasn't too crazy about them. They, they're okay. I'm not saying they're bad tasting. It's just they, they're kind of sweet, and um, they are. Right. You know, they other people in my household liked them. So like them. So anyway, like I said, that's the vanilla and the lemon. Uh, we also had chocolate. It's gone. I was going to pick up another one for the haul, but I never got around to it. So hey, it is what it is. And then another one that we haven't opened or tried yet is this one, strawberry. It also came in strawberry. So I have all the varieties except for the chocolate. Chocolate one is missing. So we want to give this a try and see how we like this. All of them were 99 cents. So that's excellent. And then as I was, you know, trying those, I, I kept seeing these for a while. 
So I decided to give this a try because it said it was chocolate with hazelnuts. Uh, this is Baduco or some brand. Anyway, so I tried these and guess what? These aren't as sweet as those. And I actually like these better for some reason. 6.3, 6.35 um, ounce. Let me see. Can I find a date? That would be great. I didn't even give you the date on those ones, huh? Okay. It's a, oh, great date. It's um, December 17, 2018. And I forgot the hubby did check the dates on these. Like this one right here is November. This is a strawberry one from the other brand, Original Gourmet, and it's November twenty third, two thousand. I think all of the all of the ones by this brand are in November of this coming uh, this year. So just so you know, anyway, I'm not gonna pull them back out, but I really like this. We can't stop eating them. Actually, we we've we've eaten two bags already. I think two or three, <laughs> and I think I got one more around here somewhere. But I'm gonna be grabbing some more of these because they really are good and they're not too sweet okay all right oh this was another fresh thing i grabbed some more bananas dole bananas that's a name brand they were um 49 cents a pound you know how i do with my smoothies and stuff like that and my son likes them um the hubby picked this up he's so silly we grabbed some of these before for my daughter i think at target or something anyway they're boo 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 <laughs> i don't know what they're called anyway they're like a, a strawberry gummy candy and marshmallow with chocolate cover coating. I tried it before with my daughter. It was pretty good. Um, she loves anything with marshmallows. You get three of them in a the pack. Uh, I can't remember what we paid for them. The single one at night, um, Target. So anyway, but I think it's a good deal. Uh, we grabbed um, some more of this uh, Sun Sweet uh, Delight um, Prune Juice. Um, you get six cans expiration date. It just says February 2018. So I don't know what day this month, but they're going to be gone. Like the last one it's a repeat buy by the way and it was 99 cents so that was good all right the hubby was being a kid of course he loves anything with peanut butter these are the reese's miniature cups i wasn't happy about the price they're 199 i don't know you get 7.1 ounce it feels pretty heavy i don't know how many comes in here but yeah i just let them go and get them and uh we actually grabbed these by hostess these are hostess blueberry muffins we actually had two of them but i think my daughter ate one made with real blueberries it's a 5.5 ounce package expiration date oh, february 23rd 2018 so yeah, that was cool all right another cool find was these were hostess hostess cinnamon streusel coffee cakes you get eight individually wrapped cakes um let me see expiration date February 15, 2018 is 11.6 ounce package. Pretty much all I can tell you about them, right? But they were 99 cents and it's a hostess. It's a good brand. So that we do know. Okay, we also grabbed these hostess, hostess bakery petites. We've gotten the big bag in these and these are small. They're new. This is uh, made with real vanilla. No artificial flavors or colors. No high fruit fructose corn syrup. These are the um, fudge blondie crispy thins. It's only a two point we got 2.12 um, bag and actually I believe these were two for 99 cents but we didn't realize it when we bought it so we only had got one but we're going to give them a try and see how we like them we still try the small bag we like the big bag we see that we'll grab that one day uh, we also got these Milky Way marshmallows with caramel they're minis three ounces um, like I said my daughter loves anything with um, uh, marshmallows and I love caramel <laughs> All right, we grab my son some more of his hostess powdered donuts, his favorite. Uh, 10.5 ounce package. Expiration date is February 23rd, 2018. He was done with that bigger uh, pack. I don't know if I got a date on here. Yes, I do. It's a. It just say um, December 2018. And this right here. Uh. Let's see. Oh, June. June 12th, 2018. For that. I think I gave you the date on everything. Okay. All right. Another cool find was this. Um, it's by Tasty Bite. It's an organic brown rice. This is a new family size. It serves for its whole grain. Brown rice delicately seeks, steamed. It's a open and heat. Uh, ready to eat. Microwavable in 90 seconds. That's pretty good. It's USDA organic. 16 ounce package. That was cool. You know what? I really should have grabbed two of these. <laughs> to be honest with you guys. Date. It's a cool date. Look. April 30th, 2018. So that's really good. Good date. All right. It says vegan, gluten free, no preservatives, no M MSG, and it's kosher. So that's cool. Let's keep it kosher. All right. Another cool find was this Betty Crocker. It says new Betty's original recipe scratch cake mix. 
chocolate joy just seven ingredients in the box you know everybody try to uh, keep you know limit their ingredients i guess it's supposed to be better or something anyway no preservatives no artificial flavors no artificial colors expiration date may 12 2018 oh wow around my birthday all right uh 1.3 uh 32 ounces let me see what else can i tell you about it really nothing else to tell you i'm gonna let the kids try to make this cake and see how it comes out all right I also picked up some more of this classical extra version olive oil. This is the Mediterranean blend. It's not as big as the ones we had before. This is a 16.9 full, full ounce bet, um, bottle. It says fresh taste. Extra version day is March 28, 2018. So you know me. I love my extra version olive oil. Oh yeah, I got this. This was cool. I got these today, actually. I saw these apples and I was like, what do you look like? I guess it's, it say I'm perfect inside beautifully imperfect naturally delicious i guess it's like between an apple and a pear they called them when they rung up they came up what did they say the name of these oh right here nikita nikita apples now i was kind of disappointed because it wasn't labeled and when i got up to the register it rung up for 199 so i wasn't ha happy with it but i was so hungry and i really wanted to try these apples and they really look delicious you guys they look so delicious and they're firm i like my fruit to be firm i don't like no mushy fruit i like it to be firm hard a eh? Anyway, yeah, so I'm really excited to try these. I hope, I, I think I'm going to enjoy them, me and the kids, actually. Okay, let me get this back here. Uh, we actually picked up some more of this ancient uh, yellow cornmeal. I think my daughter said we were out of cornmeal, so hey, got this. Expiration date, April 9th, 2018. We just had fried some fish last night, some catfish and another kind of fish, so yeah, we needed some cornmeal. All right. I got some beverages. Uh, this is the zero calorie nature wise whole body vitality drink. Very good. I don't I can't pronounce it like last time. Anyway, I don't even see a date. Don't worry about it. I think it was 99. It could have been two for 99. I don't know. Oh, okay. These were pretty exciting. Well, for me it was. I kept seeing these and I kept posting pictures, but I never bought them. And then this lady I ran into who shops there and she was talking to me and um she always talked to me when she sees me and she said they were really good and I meant to grab some and I finally did and she she was like she had a heck of them and we was talking again just uh was it yesterday kind of find out she's from Oakland like me so yeah we were vibing and talking and uh yeah she said this is really good this is the friends fun wine Moscato original strawberry Moscato and she said they're really good has six percent alcohol and, uh, and that's what another thing she had told me. She told me they were two for 99 and I was going to check and I had forgotten. I didn't grab them. So I got, okay, so I got two of the original strawberry Moscato. They were two for 99 again. And this is another, they have a white one, but I didn't see it when I went back. I should have grabbed them when the grid, she the one probably took all of them. That's probably why there was nothing left. This is the Chardonnay. Well, the Chardonnay is kind of, it's a white wine. It says the uh, coffee cappuccino. And she said this one was good too. It says serve chilled. Uh, let me see. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Anyway, I grabbed two of this variety. Also, it's one more variety that I saw. But I found the box of them and for well, the box before, before I bought them. And they come in a lot of different varieties that I don't have. <laughs> so I'm going to, you know, try them and see if they're really good like she says they are. And uh, yeah. I'll be picking up. I don't know why the hubby grabbed this. This is the Mountain Dew. Nothing exciting. Kickstart, Energizer, Mango Lime. Uh, why? And then he also grabbed this uh, by Monster. Monster is a Chaos Energy Plus Juice. All right. Nothing exciting, you guys. Of course, because he grabbed it, right? <laughs> All right. I'll grab this cheesecloth. I'll say you can use it for a craft and hobby. You can use it for cooking too. Canning, baking, basting, poaching, um, straining, wrapping. Cheese making, wine making. It was 99 cents, so 100% bleach. Grab that. All right. This is a repeat buy. We always grab these full wrappers now because it fits perfectly in our toaster oven. Okay. We also grab some little um, Ziploc bags, uh, freezer bags. Store. Nothing exciting. Everybody grab these from the Dollar Tree and 99 cent store, right? <laughs> I think. All right. Let me see. Did I finish on this half of the table? Oh. I saw Miss Vivian Rodriguez post this big thing of uh, mail. Now, when she posted it, she was saying how big. It was. I didn't really realize how big it was. So I actually saw it in the store, and it's Crack Real Mail. Uh, 
same great taste made with cage free whole eggs uh, creamy and smooth with no artificial flavors. This is, this is a 60 fluid ounce. Now, I bought a regular big jar of mayonnaise and Miracle Whip and all that kind of stuff. I've never bought one this big, you know. But now um, that I have it, and I think it's expiring soon. Let me see. Okay. Yeah, February 25th, 2018. So what I'm planning on doing with this, it was okay because I can make a, a nice, you know, big size potato salad, a macaroni salad. Uh, Sometimes I do shrimp macaroni salad. Um, I can do some tuna, which I, I'm kind of blue. I like my solid white albacore. You can do like a chicken salad sandwich. You can do so many things, but I don't prefer mayonnaise on my like burgers or sandwiches and that like that. But I do mix it in, you know, dishes like that. So you may see some of that coming up really soon, you guys. Okay, guys, I have one more item <laughs> that I almost kind of forgot. Uh, these are some mushrooms. It's by... Let's say Guan's mushrooms, 100% natural gourmet meals made quick and eat, quick, easy, and delicious. This is the what oyster, yeah, oyster mushroom. Um, it says profile mild, sweet flavor with delicate texture. I don't really see no, I've seen some recipe ideas, way to, ways to use it, but it says, um, oh. Made in Los Angeles. Well, I guess they're from Los Angeles. Product USA. Anyway, this one's a variety. I'm not sure what other ones are out there, but these are the ones that I got. This is another one. California grown, uh, specialty mushrooms. Uh, I thought these were. I thought this one was the what they call them shiitake, but I'm not sure if this is a shiitake one. But the other one is an oyster one. You guys know, and you know what? I searched high and low. But I can't find the expiration date. These are 99 cents as well. Um, they're both like 4 ounces, I think. Yeah, like 4 ounces. So yeah, I can't find the expiration date. But yeah, this is another cool find. I have a recipe possibly coming up with these as well. So something I use mushrooms in. So um, just look out for that just in case I, I'm able to get it out and share it, share it with you guys. I grabbed these um, Senor. Uh, roasted red peppers and brine, 12 ounce bottle. I saw somebody cooking something. They was using a lot of red, red uh, uh, roasted red peppers. Um, somebody I just started uh, subscribed to on YouTube. Nice young lady. Anyway, uh, expiration day is August 25th, 2018. So I was interested in trying it. All right, now these I forgot. Maybe a haul or two. <laughs> I grabbed all the other varieties, like the little princes, the other little blue ones, and the s'mores ones. This is like the fourth variety. I think this is the final one. This is a Jello Creations dessert kit. Uh, like I said, I have forgot it, and so so I'm gonna include it in this haul. Um, Oreo dirt cups includes gummy creatures, uh, Oreo crumbs, pudding, mixed chocolate. My son's been trying to tear into this. Make six servings, just add milk, and uh, not, cups not included. Expiration date April 24, 21st, 2018. I also grabbed these uh, Nabisco. Uh, honey made graham crackers. This is a repeat buy. My kids really love these. I feel good about giving them to them because they're whole grain. Made with real honey. No high fructose, fructose corn syrup. 8 grams of whole grains per serving. Okay. 14.4 ounce package. Expiration date March 15, 2018. So yeah, we were out. And I was telling you guys my daughter wanted me to make her some s'mores. So yeah. I also grabbed this. Never grabbed this before. Liquid from the makers of Shore Gel. It's called Serto. Premium liquid fruit pectin for homemade jams and jellies. New look, same great taste. Um, two liquid pouches inside. Uh, expiration date is excellent. It's September 11, 2018. I grabbed this because I, it reminded me of my childhood. Um, when I was a little, a little girl, one of our babysitters, she had a plum tree in her backyard. And she would go out there and pick plums, and then she would come in and make fresh, like, plum jam. And that was the best tasting ever. So I want to experiment and see if I can make my own. And someone uh, wrote me on um, Instagram and commented and <laughs> said something about, you can use this to make candles too. Now I always, I, I make candles. I haven't made no candles in a while. I still got candle making supplies. I was just gonna change up my scents, but uh, I have, I'm gonna get back into making candles. So I guess I'll look up, try to see how you do it, how you do it with the candles. She said also, y'all, it's probably TMI y'all. People use this, I never heard of it. <laughs> never had a reason to do it use this to pass a drug test i never heard of that before if y'all heard of that let me know because i swear i never heard of that before and not that i would need to i'm drug free <laughs> i may be crazy y'all but i am drug free 
Okay. I guess I'll get, finish this side of the table. Okay. So I was uh, I picked up some makeup bags today. This one I think is more like a wallet. It says keep calm and shop on. I really needed that because y'all know I'd be on here shopping like crazy. So it looks more like a wallet. It's really cute. And I really like this what the little saying it has on there. Alright. I got this for my daughter. I thought this was so cute. It's like a little mini mouse, like a little I don't know, it's like a little cosmetic bag or whatever. And I think it's authentic Disney. It has this little thing on it. And it says something about visit DisneyJunior.com made in China. And she, you know, watches this. She, now she's thinking she's too good for Disney Junior. That's for kids. I don't, she don't like to watch Disney and not Disney Junior. But my son, son watches Disney Junior. Oh, okay. I dropped something. Anyway, I thought this was really cute, you guys, for her. Okay, I also grabbed this one right here. It's so cute. Look at the little stripes, like the little foot locker, the little you know, black and white stripes. And it says hashtag selfie kit. I thought this was so cute. So I grabbed one of these because we may keep it or we may use it in the giveaway. Which, uh, yeah, you guys, I'm going to have a giveaway coming real soon. Don't think I forgot about y'all. Uh, I haven't forgot. I'm still working on it and it's going to be coming really soon. So I, I want to do an appreciation giveaway. This is the same thing, hashtag selfie kit, but except this one is bigger than this one. I don't know if you can tell, but. Yeah, one is bigger, so I got one of each. I may go back and get some more because if you guys check out my Instagram, it's the same handle as here as uh, the Mom Life Seven, and I posted pictures of a lot of other cute um, makeup bags similar to those that I purchased. I mean that I I ran into today. I took pictures. I couldn't buy them all, y'all, but I did want to. Don't get it twisted. Should I go here? Well, I guess I can since I'm here. Okay. I had saw these and I started grabbing them, then I saw a heck of other people getting them. And here we are. Um, this one I just found today. This is the concealer brush. These are by Baby Beauty Forever Young. All right, we all trying to stay forever young. So I grabbed two of the concealer brush. I grabbed two of everything because I'm gonna like try to keep one for us to see, you know, if my daughter likes them, how we like them, and then the other ones are gonna go in a giveaway. So well, that's the plan for now. <laughs> and then I also found this moist powder brush. No, moist powder eye brush. All right, grab two of those as well. And then I have the eyeliner brush. I grabbed two of these as well. And then I have the small eyeshadow brush. Grab two of those as well. So yes, I can't wait to try them and or let my daughter try them or whatever, okay? We also found these uh, makeup brush cleaners. Um, I found these purple ones. I seen people posting pictures. They have found pink and black, but I didn't find those colors. I don't know if you can see the little ridges back there, but yeah, I thought these are pretty neat. So I got one for us and one for a giveaway. So I got, like I said, two of each. Uh, I know I probably mentioned I'm not crazy about the Smoke and Mirror brand. Well, my daughter wasn't either. And um, I told her, I said, well, they got some new stuff. She's like, uh-uh, I'm done with that brand. So I decided, I know a lot of people is looking for this brand and like this brand. So I decided to grab some anyway for a giveaway. We may still try it again. Is this a, okay, Espresso. So I got two of these. One we maybe can try and do it. This is Espresso. This is the... um. Light, wait, flexible. I think it's like some kind of bra gel. Oh, yeah, that's what it says. Bra gel. I got two of these. And right here, some eyes. It's an eyeshadow palette, I think. Rose gold shadows. Um, you get, let me see, shy and, and enhance. Morocco, bitten, cocoa, goddess. Anyway, all these were 99 cents, by the way. Like I said, everything I mentioned or everything I showed you so far was 99 cents. Just in case you're wondering, I also grabbed this double ended eyeliner. Uh, it says just wing it. I got two different colors on each end, each end has a different color. And this is another one, another color variation. And they say they're waterproof, just wing it. Oh, okay, light brown and dark brown. And this one has black shimmer and worry. No, ivory shimmer. <laughs> How's it work? I can't see y'all. Uh, ivory shimmer. I didn't even know the colors were on there. I'm just seeing it now for the first time. <laughs> I just grabbed it. I thought it was cute. These are the liquid highlighters. This is um, Moonlight. And this is Rose Gold. So I got those. I was just trying to grab different colors. Because I don't know what colors people are like if they win. You know. Alright. Now these are the brown. This is a bronzer. It's a honey. A bronzer and honey. This is a uh, powder foundation that's in tan. All right. Also got this powder foundation in dark brown. I think it's another color out there. Well, I may grab some more uh, as soon as I can, you know, get back out. And this is a highlighter. It's in golden. All right. So I thought that was pretty interesting. I also grabbed this um, hair turban. They it was a lot of other different patterns and colors, and I posted them on my Instagram. So. 
be sure to check that out if you're interested in something like this. It was 99 cents. I thought I'd get out of try. All right, the hubby grabbed this auto wheel brush. He got grabbed the or clean the um the wheels on the car. Nothing exciting. It was 99 cents as well. All right, I'll also grab. Oh, excuse me. These hand sanitizer wipes for my kids. You get 30 wet wipes. This is the Barbie. And you also get 30. These is the SpongeBob. And it said made in the USA. All right, cool. And I also grabbed these. Those were 99 cents. I grabbed these Purell hand sanitizer wipes. And these are two for 99 cents. You get 15 in here. It kills 99% of illness causing germs. All right. Also, I've been saying this for a while and wanted to pick it up. And I finally gave in. Personal ear cleaners. Clean, clean air. Ear cleaner, cleaner, soft, flexible plastic. Removes wax, itch relief, and exfoliates. So two count, I grabbed two packs to give them a try. I also grabbed these Clackers dental brush, dental brushes, <laughs> high performance. Uh, yeah, you get four of them in here, so we're gonna give those a try. Ninety-nine cent. I also grabbed these uh, stuffy nose wipes, extra soft wipes to clean little noses and faces. I grabbed these before, so this is a repeat by the Paw Patrol. Of course, it wouldn't be a mom life haul without grabbing my son his uh, Hot Wheels. <laughs> I really thought this was cute. Look at the colors on there. It's like the colors like a it's like a Rubik's cube or something. Although it's really funky, it's cute. Anyway, nothing special or you know exciting to you guys, but to him it's special. <laughs> I also grabbed these right here, uh, Wuggle Pets. This is the Playful Pony Kit. Build them with love and care. And uh, includes Playful Pony, Backpack Clip, Fluffy Stuffing, Magic Dust, Personality Charms, Birth Certificate, Zipper 2. I thought these were pretty cool, ages four and up, and it also was only 99 cents. I grabbed a Playful Pony, and we also grabbed a Bashful Bear Kid. I thought these were really cool set as seen on TV. I didn't even see them on TV. But the reason I thought they was cute, cool because my daughter has been asking me to take them to the Build-A-Bear workshop. And I, I heard how expensive that place is. I'm still going to take them. I was just you know, trying to make sure I'll be ready for that when we go in because my kids are going to go ham on it. This is nothing too exciting. This is the Puff Plus Lotion. I'm, I'm steady grabbing these, you know, because we've been under the weather. And this is the Kleenex. Uh, tissues, nothing exciting or special. Uh, we also grabbed some more Fabuloso, Fabuloso with baking soda. All right, 99 cents, nothing too exciting. And I, I don't know if you guys remember my last haul video, I had grabbed that chalkboard for my son. So this is some liquor chalk markers. I never tried liquor chalk before. So I'm gonna get this a try. Comes with three colors, it was 99 cents. And we also grabbed these, Oh, that is big. Big mistake eraser, <laughs> delete and my bad. Aren't those cute, they heavy. Ooh, that's some big erasers. All right. I've also been getting ready for my kids' uh, Valentine's Day gift bags, finally. So I'm going to have a lot more stuff coming up for you in my next haul, which is that Dollar Tree haul. Anyway, check this out. These are the bubble tubes. I got these. Oh, they were 99 cents. These are zipper bags. All right. And then I grabbed these uh, sticker boxes. Sticker boxes. So... Yeah, let me see if I can grab this other stuff over here. All right. The hubby grabbed these um, electronic wipes. I thought this was pretty cool. This lady that uh, I, shop, I run into while shopping here. Came apart, don't worry about it. And she spotted this. We were going down the aisle and we were, you know, chatting it up about what we found. You know, we always talk when we see each other. And I saw, she saw this. And I said, this is pretty neat. I was like, I could probably hang this in my car. Uh, you know to put stuff in. I don't know what it is. It's like a little bag pouch. It has compartments on it. Look inside. Oh, sorry. It's pretty deep. It's pretty deep. It's pretty big. Uh, I don't know how many inches. On it. And it has this little clip thing on it. I don't know if you can see it. And it has wheels on it too as well, you guys. So yeah, I thought it was neat and cool. I don't know what it's for, but this um, thing was sitting near the on it i said 199 i don't know if that was the actual price i took it up there and i told the girl i said i don't know if this is one she said well today it is i said all right thank you this is uh um one of the nice girls that work there who always you know help me out and stuff so yeah anyway it was cool so yeah this is pretty cool i don't know what it is but yeah i want to give it a try if you guys know let me know but i'm gonna use it for something <laughs> okay i saw these uh they're called 
broccoli and cough drops. So I never tried them before. I thought I'd give them a try. 22 drops in here. Temporary Calms Cough, Soothe, Sore Throat. They were 99 cents. And I saw they have another variety today, but I didn't grab that one. And I grabbed these rugs right here. They're uh, truly home, but they're brought truly home. They were originally $1.99, but they were on a 50 in a cart that said 50% off. And um, it says a jagged rug. So I got this like it's like a, a brown and white, like chocolate color. And then I got this one right here. It's like a gray and white one. And um, I don't know what happened when the lady rung them up, but it was only one on my receipt for 99 cents. So I actually got these for basically 49 cents each. So how cool is that? All right. I also had grabbed this um, the 24 inch uh, handheld plastic duster. It was $2.99. I wasn't happy about the price, but I grabbed the purple one. They had a lot of different colors. I had posted some pictures of these on Instagram. So yeah, I'm gonna get this to try and get the dust in around this house, y'all. Okay, that's all I have for you guys today. Oh, I'm out of breath with this haul right here, and I didn't think it was that big, and that's why I wanted to combine it with my Dollar Tree haul, but it's too much stuff to combine it. So anyway, um, that's all I have for you guys. Uh, like I say, look out for my new videos that are gonna be coming up. Uh, let me see. I'm trying to cut down on hauling and do more like organizing and cleaning and try to find room for all this stuff around here, y'all. So that's why I'm going to be uh, featuring a lot more cooking videos and other stuff coming up. Uh, if you haven't already, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Uh, please give me a big thumbs up. I appreciate all your support. And uh, I see you guys out there. And I, I, I'm pretty much figuring out who my regulars are and who always comment and leave me nice, wonderful comments. And I just want to know I appreciate all you guys. And the feeling is mutual. Uh, please don't forget, to, um, if you aren't already, to subscribe to my uh, partner in crime are my twin <laughs> uh, Vian Rodriguez uh, down in Southern California and um, Sway to the 99 on Instagram. Vian Rodriguez has an Instagram and a YouTube channel as well and uh, there's a lot of other wonderful YouTubers out there so yeah just go out there and support everybody especially the small YouTubers like myself. Um, I appreciate everyone and uh, hopefully I don't forget anything and I will see you guys in the next one.